Good morning, folks. Um, so, illness has struck Haywire Homestead. My husband um, got some type of a, a, a virus, I guess. Um, it's definitely respiratory. Sore throat, congestion, and cough, and all of that. Um, and I thought I was coming down with it, but now I'm not sure because I've got a little bit of stomach upset. But as soon as I got home from my hunting trip and he was already sick, I started taking my fermented honey garlic and lots of vitamin C. Um, these packets can just be mixed in water um, to try to boost my immune system since I already have an immune system that isn't the best with my Hashimoto's. Um, so this morning I'm feeling even worse and I have an upset stomach. So I thought I would share with y'all, um, this is something that's just a rice, almost like a, a porridge. Um, it's been sitting a little bit cause I had to go out and feed the animals. So it's a little thicker than normally when I first get it out. But, um, this was actually taught to me by, um, my ex mother-in-law. Um, and she is from Okinawa, Japan. And this is what they always used to give to the kids or even the adults um, when they were sick, especially if you have an upset tummy, to help soothe the stomach and help boost the immune system. So all it is is just plain old rice. You can use long grain, short grain, it, it, jasmine, it, it, that's not the important part. Um, but you're going to use bone broth, um, and I make my own. So you put that in there. Um, for every one cup of rice you do normally would do two cups of water, this you're actually gonna add um, extra. So I have two cups of rice in here and six cups of bone broth um, to make it a little bit more mushy and softer. And then you're gonna put enough garlic in here to kill a vampire. So I've got eight cloves of crushed garlic in here. And then I also have um, a, like one inch nub of ginger that I diced up. As well ginger is good for the digestion your garlic has got your anti uh, microbial properties in it both of them are good for boosting the immune system and then just a little bit of redmond sea salt um, you can also add uh, hot chili uh, flakes to it um, so it helps um, soothe everything but cook it like you normally would your rice and then turn it off let it sit for a couple of minutes and um, you can even add more water to it or more bone broth if you wanted it a little bit more um, soupy because she always called it soupy rice because it would be a soupy consistency mine sat a little too long and absorbed the rest of the water um <laughs> so uh it's a little bit thicker than like i said normal but uh i just wanted to share that with y'all i'm going to be having this this is going to be my breakfast this morning and hopefully um along with everything else i'm taking it gets me it knocks this uh virus out and then i get to feeling better but y'all take care thanks for watching bye